So one thing that I've really been learning lately and paying attention to and trying to make more time for is just relaxing because you know a lot of times especially when you get when you start getting into self-improvement and whatnot you want to be as productive as possible you want to get as much work done as you can and be as productive and, and produce as much as you can you know um but i've learned that relaxing is just as productive as being productive um and the reason why i say that is because when when you're always, uh, I guess, spending energy and you're not taking time to recover, you can only, the quality of what you put out is only going to be so good and eventually it's going to decrease over time. Especially because when you're not recovering, you're not rebuilding that energy back up. So I've learned to just relax when you can. You know, obviously, I'm not going to say relax all the time because it's like you have to get up and go. You have to get up and do things. But at the same time, you also got to remember to just chill out. And I know in the beginning for me, it was hard for me to not be doing something or be working on something or be working towards something. But now, since I've really, I guess, adopted this whole slowing down and and kind of taking the time to assess where I'm at and look at where I am and where I've been and where I want to be and whatnot it makes it a lot easier and I feel like I'm not working as hard and I feel like I'm not I feel like things I feel like when you take time to just chill and really just relax and not try to be so productive it makes the quality of work you do later on better because you took that time to gather more energy gather more focus gather more information uh uh and you take more time to really put into play all the things that you've learned because you're not constantly trying to put things out you know um so i'm I'm not gonna be one of those people that tells you like you gotta you gotta work on it every day every day every day like yeah to a degree Certain things are like that, but overall, I don't think that that's the way to live life. Like, I think if you can't relax and chill while still going for the things that you want, I feel like it's going to take a little longer for you to get them. And even when you do get them, you might not appreciate them that much because now you're worried about the next thing, you know. And that's a that's a trap that I kind of fell into myself. Is And I'm still kind of in it. I'm not going to lie to you. Like, it's it's like I'm just now learning these things. You know, like I don't I don't ever want to be like there's so many people that overwork themselves and give their whole uh, their whole life to their work or whatever. And it might not even be their life's work. It might just be their job that they just work a lot of hours at, you know. But yeah, man, we got to stop thinking that uh, just chilling, relaxing. Doing things that are just simple and easy and, and just and like not putting all this energy out and focus more on the inside than we do the outside. Because honestly, I think the more you focus on the inside, all the things that you truly want, they start to come to you because you're kind of like embodying that thing instead of um, trying so hard to make the outside world or what's on the outside, trying to make that move and shape and shift into what you want it to be if that makes sense um but i think it just helps us focus on the inside more and it gives us a a better sense of direction because we're not constantly trying to move 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 we're taking the time to sit down and unpack things and really look at okay i'm here i'm there i'm trying to go there i've been here you know you just get a better sense of where you are when you when you just take time to just chill out and just 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 relax man it's I'm just now, it's just now clicking for me. Like, relaxing is just as important as being productive. And depending on how you do it, it can be just as productive. Because I noticed for me, like, when I'm not doing anything, that's when I get the most ideas for writing or 
making videos and stuff like that. Like that's when I get all my ideas. I get all my ideas during my downtime. And then I usually what I'll do is I'll try to write them all down or keep the ones that are good and leave the ones that aren't so good. And then uh, when I start moving again, that's when I'll that's when I'll put those ideas out. But it's not even like I'm trying to come up with an idea because usually when I try to come up with an idea, it doesn't flow right. But when I take the time to just relax, chill, the ideas start just coming to me and then I just pick from the ones that I want to use. So anyway, man, I don't want to drag it out too long. Um Learn how to take time to just relax and chill, man. I understand that we live in a very go, go, go society and whatnot. And for me, that just don't work. Like working a full time job is enough. <laughs> it's enough. So on top of the stuff that I'm trying to do to get out of that, you know, nine to five job, stuff like that. Like I don't want to be spinning my wheels to where I don't have time to do those things either. So just learn to relax. It's just as productive as going out and doing what you got to do. It can be, you know, it's just you just got to really be able to give your brain that time to come up with these new, fresh ideas and in like a safe environment and everything will kind of just come to you, man. So that's pretty much all I got, man. Y'all take it easy, please. <laughs> and I'm going to catch y'all on the next one, man. Peace.